बिस्मिल्लाम वेलकम टू माई चैनल लर्न मैथ विथ सैयद अली हेयर इज द असाइनमेंट क्वेश्चन थ्री सर्कल्स ऑफ रेडियस सेवन फोर पॉइंट फाइव एंड एट सेंटीमीटर आर गिवेन आई मेक वन बिग सर्किल दैट हैज द सेम एरिया ऑफ द सम ऑफ द थ्री सर्किल्स वट इज द रेडियस ऑफ दिस बिग सर्किल दिस इज पार्ट ए and part b of this question is i am making three identical three identical circle their total area is the same as the big circle of the part a what is the radius of each circle so question part a he says there are three circles so three circles first has got radius of 7 second has radius of 4.5 third has radius of 8 cm what you need to do you need to find out the area of each individual circle because i make a circle a big circle right i make a circle like a big circle so i make like this right and my circle which i make a big circle my circle radius big circle that has the same area my area of this big circle is the same is the sum of the three circles so that means i have to find out area of each circle area 1 area 2 area 3 and then i have to sum them up because he is saying that i make a big circle whose area is sum of the three circles so what is area of the circle right pi r square so area is pi r square so we have to calculate individual area of the circle pi r square again pi r square here again let me make some space pi r square again and individual circles radius is given so 3.14 times 7 square right and this area a1 will be equals to if you multiply this or you can write one more time 3.14 times this 49 and a1 will be equals to 153.94 right then you calculate second area area is equals to 3.14 times 4.5 square and this will gives you another area the area of the second circle which is 63.62 similarly you calculate third area again pi r square and this time r is 8 so 8 times 8 is 64 when you multiply this with pi 3.14 times 64 and you multiply them so you get a3 third area of the circle and you have here how much 50.27 so what question is saying i draw a big circle whose area is equals to sum of all these circles a1 plus a2 plus a3 this is the area right of the big circle which i make big so what is that a1 is 153.94 plus 63.63 plus 50.27 so that will be the area of the big circle because question is saying that the big circle has the area as the sum of the three circles so if you add all these three areas a1 a2 a3 you will be getting 267.83 centimeter square this is the area of the big circle area of the big circle this is your first part or answer right first part answer now second part is saying that i am making three identical circle three identical circle their total area their total area is the same as the 
big circle area, right? So total area is this. This is my big circle area, right? So he's saying that I am making three identical circles whose total area, like I am making three identical circles this time. One, two, three, identical circle. So whose area is equals to, like if you add them, whose area is this thing, right? Find the radius of each circle. So we have to find out the radius of each circle. There are three identical circles. Over there was not identical circle, right? Now, if we have the area, so of the big circle, that means A big is equals to 267.83, but he is making three circles. So you have to divide by three to get area of the individual circle, right? So to get the area of the individual circle, we have to divide this big circle area by three. So we did so. And when we divide it by three, we have 89.28. This is area of each circle this time in the part B, right? So if I say in the part B, what is my A1, right? So each circle has got the same area, 89.28 each. Each of them has got this area because they are identical circles. I am making three identical circles. Their total area is the same as the big circle. So we have to divide by three because they are all identical and we have to find out what is area of each circle. So here area of each circle is A1 is equals to A2 is equals to A3. All are equal, right? All are equal. So A1 is equals to A2 is equals to A3. And what is that number? 89.28. So, what is the area? Area is equals to pi r square, right? Pi r square, and we have to find out the radius of each circle, right? So, area is, we can plug it in here, and we can say that 89.28, right, is equals to pi 3.14, times r square or we can say that r square is equals to what is r square equals to so 3.14 will be going into the denominator 89.28 divided by 3.14 and we divide so what we get if we take the now we have to take the square root right so right now i will write what we get by the division so we get 28.432 and to get r what we have to do we have to take the square root of 28.432 and if we take the square root we get r is equals to whatever we get by square rooting the square root gives us 5.33 centimeter so this time my area of three identical circles was 89.28 and the radius of each circle so they are all equal right so i can say that this this was a1 is equals to a2 is equals to a3 right which was 89.28 and r1 is equals to r2 is equals to r3 they are identical circle so their radius should be same their area should be same so what is the radius of the of these identical circles the area of the these identical circles are 5.33 centimeter right so you answer both part this was your assignment question uh, you can have a look i will go through it one more time with you so that you understand it uh, clearly that what is given what you need to do so here is the question three circles of the radius 7, 4.5 and 8 centimeter, these are the three circles, are given. I make one big circle. This is my one big circle which I make, right? What is given? The area of this big circle is the sum of the three circles, these three circles. So what we have to do? We have to find out individual area of each circle. So area 1, area 2 and area 3. So we calculate all three areas and what we need to do we need to 
sum up all these three individual areas so that we can find out area of the big circle. When we have area of the big circle, question is saying, what is the radius of this big circle? So we use the formula that what is the radius of the big circle? So area, we know that area is equals to pi r square, right? So what we have to find out? We have to find out area of the big circle, right? So what we need to find out? Area of the big circle. We add them all up. But question is saying, what is the radius? What is the radius of the big circle? So radius is equals to a divided by pi under the root, right? So r is equals to a is given because we calculate, we sum up all those things. So 267, 267.83 divided by pi, 3.14. And when you calculate this and take the square root, it gives you 9.23. So 9.23, I did not calculate it before because I just calculated the area, area of the big circle and jump up to the next part. So this is my radius. Question is asking about radius. He's not asking about um, the, what is the area of the big circle. First, we have to find out area of the big circle by adding all three areas. And then we have to use the formula A is equals to pi r square. So r is equals to under root A divided by pi. Pi is 3.14. Area we calculated 263, 267.683. And when we calculate it by the calculator, we have 9.23 centimeter. Always put up the unit, right? Now, part B is saying that I am making three identical circle this time. So this time is identical circle, right? So we make three identical circle. So we make three identical circle. Their total area is the same as the big circle. So their total area, total area, right? So we have to divide this big circle area by three. So what is the individual circle area? 89.28 centimeter. This is the individual area of the three identical circle. But what we need to find out, what is the radius of each circle? This time we have to find out the radius of these circles, which are identical. So we once, one, once again, we use the same formula, a is equals to pi r square and substitute the values. Pi is 3.14, right? And area is 89.28 to calculate r. And we calculate r is equals to 5.33 centimeter. Hope you like the video. If you like it, subscribe my channel, press the bell icon button to receive another video. Uh, share my channel with your friends and family friends. Uh, maybe because this is, these are the holiday season, right? This is summer vacation. So you can spend uh, one hour, half hour with your kids, right? If they are in grade eight, I have some videos for each grade and I am developing it for more and more for each grade. From, I have started from grade 8, but I have few videos for 9, 10, 11, and 12. So I will try to focus all those questions which are being sent by my, um, by my students. And I at the top of the board, you can see that send me your questions at s underscore shahid underscore ali at hotmail.com. So I will answer your questions through this YouTube channel. Thank you for watching.